For this hit sequence, we'll be performing two exercises. We're gonna go toe taps at steady state for about 10 seconds, and then burpees for 10 seconds. Back to toe taps for 10, back to burpees, back to toe taps, back to burpees. So three of each, 10 seconds of each, totaling a minute. With this circuit, what we want is, if you have a ball, great. If you don't have a ball, we can use a bench as well. You can use a chair, you can use the edge of your bed, and if you don't have any of those, then I'll give you an alternate in a second. Your toe taps are just gonna be back and forth like so, 10 seconds, nice steady state, and then burpees. The one thing is, I'd like your burpees to be elevated, because I find burpees from the floor can be really challenging, sometimes on the knees and the lower back. A little bit of elevation, you're gonna notice as I I go down for my burpees, I have a nice straight back and I'm gonna reach out and I pop up, reach out and pop up. So that's why we have the elevation with our burpees. If you don't have the ball, the bench, the chair, or the bed, all you're gonna do is toe taps in the air and then your 10 seconds will be jump squats, up and down like so. Toe taps back and forth, jump squats. If the jump squats are too challenging in terms of impact, just give me that little pulse squat.